Hello friends, very good evening. Welcome back to my YouTube channel, Talent Traders. Those who are new to my YouTube channel, kindly subscribe the channel to get more update on intraday and positional trading strategies. And this video, I'm going to create you the scanner, which is helping you to find out the rally base rally on daily time frame that I am going to create on this video right now so I am going to show you the step by step how to create the rally base rally a scanner on charting and if you are new to my youtube channel kindly subscribe once again and uh, let's move on to the video so the rally base rally last video we discussed about the drop based drop on daily time frame so here in that video we are going to create the rally base rally to find out a supply zone so that is a buying opportunity we are going to find out based on this pattern there is a supply zone where the supply is there in a daily time frame to get an a buy opportunity so let me go for a charting so last video we are tried and we find out finally we got it that a drop based drop and we are going to base on the same example we are going to create as a scanner and I'm using future stocks the first condition uh, where I'm going to use this for a daily time frame so we need a three candles uh, the current candle that is the latest one and previous day and before another day so first two days ago we have a positive candle we need a positive candle two days ago so let me go for the close of that particular is must be greater than this will be finding out from open so it will find out those stock which is for present as a positive candle that is uh, two days ago today is the latest day and the previous one and previous one so the th compared to current day the third day candle should be a green candle so that is what the condition which i have created here right now and the second one the day uh, one that means yesterday's candle should be a negative candle that is what our next conditions so that means the one day ago close must be less than that uh, one day ago open so this is what a negative candle and the third one we are going to create again a positive candle that is what the latest candle uh, must be positive so that is what today's it must be greater than so these are the simple conditions where we are going to find out let me go for a CIPLA, VOLTAS and ONGC uh, let me check it out whether these are right and today is positive yesterday is negative and day before yesterday it should be a positive candles so let me I'm going to check the CIPLA whether all the things are right yes a previous day should be positive and the next day should be a negative and again positive the second one is voltas let me go for a voltas what happened on that first day is a positive second day is negative and third day would be a positive okay so this may be the reversal at bottom uh, let me check it out we use a volume and uh, should be a should be a reversal at this point it should be highest volume on the day but next day it is opening with a positive so there is a big reversal opportunities in voltas and also it is a opportunity to buy at bottom so this should be your stop loss and this should be your entry point so this is what uh, different than other scanner we are creating but if you look at this chart it is having a good opportunity to buy at the lowest price uh, almost the bottom right so let me go for check uh, and from here almost 1048 now the stock is we are getting around 900 rupees it's somewhere a good price to compare to 1040 almost 140 rupees we are going to buy this stock as a discount so maybe the perfect reversal area where it is happening at this point and uh, this would be a great opportunity to invest in voltas at this point we can keep the stop loss below 868 
it's not for an intraday or a positional call it is for an investment we can go for an investment kind of trade at this point so that is what the condition and also it satisfied the demand zone right now so let me check what happened in a, a further more days but as our conditions right now it is very good and finally ongc let me go for a ongc let me go for a ongc that is also looks like good the first one but here and let's look at this ongc how that perfect uh, drop base drop works so let's look at this on a perfect drop base drop and let's look at this is what a entry and this is what a stop loss 127.5 and 127 uh, 29.10 should be the stop whenever the market reaches that price it's a supply zone where the market enters into the zone and we keep the stop loss above this level and let's look at this movement it is initially it triggers you and finally it fall down so it's a great opportunity where we can place the uh, orders at this supply zone and market is coming down so let me go for a five minute chart when it is happening by the second candle itself the price is not sustained at this level uh, the fraction of seconds maybe it triggers you 127.5 and you keep the stop loss of 129 and the stock is fall down towards 123.8 somewhere around the four rupees is down and it spikes at this point and at, at the zone like a supply and it reaches that supply zone and immediately it coming down towards big that is what the main use where we can uh, follow that supply and demand zone so let me come to the point and we are going to create uh, the demand zone for uh, daily basis the first uh, the two candles or uh, uh, third candle should be a green and second one should be a red and again uh, the latest one should be also green but we have to add some more conditions so uh, the high the the previous day high should be uh, less than greater than two days ago high yes here we are going to use the one day ago uh, high day ago high must be greater than uh, two days ago high and the second one so the one days ago low it must be greater than it must be uh, low they go low uh, what what uh, one day ago high is greater than two days ago high. and one day ago low must be greater than two days ago no. okay. yeah this uh, this condition is completed and the latest close is, that is also be satisfied and uh, finally the latest close must be greater than the two days ago close is of course close price why because of uh, first day should be a green and second day should be very flat and third day should be a green candle so that we are going to clear it out and again and yeah and the third day the latest day close must be greater than one day ago close also so if you are going to follow and let me save this can first um, So we'll save to find out the back test result if you find any back so a lot of stocks so we will take a random one so here and bought our india on 21.9 so reliance hindustan in the 21.9 so on daily time free so let me go for bought our india 21.9 
21.9 yes so this is the date compared to last previous three days the big green that is a not a big green it's a doji candle the first day should be a green and the second day should be a red and the third day should be a green so there is an area where we are finding a supply sorry demand so after that it broken and it moves small and then it fallen down it may be a trigger your stop loss and let me check it out and we have to add and one more conditions so that is uh, we are going to use that the candle should be very small so we use that bracket function to derive that candle so one day ago high minus low that high minus low It should be a one day ago. Day ago, high minus low must be greater than in a bracket. Minus low. That should be a two days ago. Days ago. Oh, multiplied by number just bit one we'll find out we'll look at this review number of stocks and let me go to check on september 19th ambuja cement and adani end ambuja cement september 19th uh, september 19th yes yeah one two three the here there is a candle we are we are focusing for one two three and there is a demand zone where we are finding out right okay and the uh, enterprise and we we can improve this one two three september 19th so that must be um, what we are expecting right so here it is one so if you are rem uh, reducing this number 0.5 so we will get a perfect stocks and let me go to check any stocks it increase i think 0.5 yes very limited number of stocks at uh, this time 17th august let me go for a bajaj finance pes Finance eight seventeen eight. It's happening on eighth August month, not this month. Seventeen eight. Yeah, that is a condition. First one should be a green. The second one is a red and third one should be a green so here we are finding a demand zone but unfortunately market not coming to the point and if you are waiting for the entry at this level it may trigger your entry and it went up and let me wait this is not the right one we are increasing that now we need to reduce 0.4 stocks so huge many stocks and we made a mistake VDL the date 9-9 yeah here is the zone one two three one green and red and green once it is broken and it went up a Atul Z entertainment on the same day one two three the day 9 September after that should be greater than close high let me try to modify this and uh, they go high and low that must be less than here we have to use less than to try we are trying this ah so here are the conditions we are going to very less number of stocks so around uh, 12th august Tata Chemical and City Union Bank. 
so tata gets killed 12th of august maybe this yes here we are finding out perfect the conditions at this level the candle which is a big green and a drop and again a rally so what kind of thing so whenever market coming to the same level so this is what the level where we are waiting for it so that level should trigger at this day on 18th august that entry point is 1093 it was triggering your 1093 and the stop loss is around 1067 immediately the next day it moves big and uh, this day it may trigger your stop loss and again this act as the supply zone again because market never closed below the level and it is retraced from that level of 1098 to the next day 1156 so that is the conditions that is the candles where we are going to focus on city union bank in bank the day itself here is the day where one and two and uh, it should be a uh, closing above the previous one uh, the current day close must be greater than the high of minus one day so if latest close greater than the uh, high we are using the high when we get a uh, one day ago high so maybe some stocks may be filled out even the city union bank will not be keep and uh, this is what on a uh, second august nakuri let me go for a uh, nakuri so how it is second august it is happening of second august or it is second august july or third, second august here is that second august the rally the base and again a rally so this may be a zone where we are finding out a buying opportunity and until this level is broken so this is the entire setup so this entire setup so until this level is a key support and meanwhile we are playing with that level to take a uh, trade opportunity and this should be a stop loss a short term but this is what the zone where we are finding out on uh, supply sorry demand and uh, we, we find out very small number of stock instead of that we can increase this value 0 0.5 even we get a uh, even many stocks on this on july 8th uh, irctc CTC, july 8th 8th of july it is 8 7 8, 7 here so it is a perfect uh, zone where it is forms on the stock at the bottom here from there it is reversed and it went up to nearby 760 from 600 and 600 level almost 160 it's not for an intraday but if we are focusing this if any stock which forms this as a very lowest level would even would be a better chances to make such a great opportunity at the bottom and uh, m and m finance at 87 let's same date m and m finance on the same date 87 maybe this uh, maybe this here 8th july it's a perfect one another perfect zone where it is reacted the market is reacted at this level so let me check it out what happened on that this water area and here again taken that demand and here it may be a stop loss but if you are keeping this stop loss for investment purpose so it should be giving you good opportunity take a trade to find out the demands at a daily basis will giving you uh, best result on your trades i hope you may enjoy this video uh, if you like this video hit the like button if you liked it kindly share to your friends if you are not yet subscribe my channel kindly subscribe the channel and if you have any questions or a doubt, just comment on the comment box. And thank you for watching this video. Thank you very much.